The decision is final. The Sullivan County Council voted within the last hour to increase one of its taxes. Good evening to you and welcome to News 10 on my Fox 10. I'm Rondrell Moore in for Patrice Dayton. It's a 1.7% increase to the economic development income tax, but not all are in favor of this increase. News 10's Richard Solomon was at that meeting. In tonight's top story, he shares why there's been some conflict. It was a 4-3 final vote that the edit tax will be raised to 1.7%. Most agree that the tax did in fact need to be raised, but the majority aren't liking how much it's raised now. Going into tonight's hearing, the edit tax was at 0.6%. Now it'll jump nearly 1.1%. Officials said it was a tough choice to raise the tax, but they believe in the end, this will be a positive for Sullivan County. Here's how that money will be broken up. 43% will go to the towns. The other 57% goes to counties. For the county, the money is going towards a new jail. Many say the county needs a jail. I spoke with people who are for and against this decision. We've got, we've got many problems that we need to take care of. This prison, the towns, the roads, the bridges. This is a tax that will help everyone in Solomon County and it's a long overdue tax. I just don't think that I could not, as an elected official for this county, feel comfortable raising the tax from six-tenths of a percent to 1.7 percent. That's a huge, huge increase that the vast majority of this county cannot afford. Council members told me people will have to start paying on this tax starting in October. Reporting live in downtown Sullivan, I'm News 10's Richard Solomon. Back to you.